This is a land which clearly understood God is our making. That's the reason why in this culture God is not the goal. Mukti is the goal, liberation is the goal, ultimate freedom is the goal. God is never the goal. Yes or no? You don't like it because you've forgotten. <laughs> Otherwise, mukti, mukti is the goal, isn't it? Mukti means what? Liberation, freedom from everything, including God. <laughs> you are using God as a stepping stone if you need it. You can grow with God or without God. This is the only culture on the planet where in any of our Indian languages, there is no word for a heretic. Because we never thought anybody is a heretic. We never imagined that there can be somebody like that. Because we did not have any established belief system, everybody can do their own thing. Most plural and democratic process for thousands of years. So, the spiritual movements were started for human liberation. This is not about God, it's about you. So when it's about you, we were straightforward enough to address it straight. We said this is about our liberation, this is about our well-being, this is about our ultimate well-being, not just immediate well-being. So this is a culture which looked at it this way. So it is a complex array of spiritual movements. Many have died, unfortunately. In the yogic system it says, when, when somebody asks Adi Yogi, how many paths can be there? He says, if you use your system and go, there are only one hundred and twelve. But if you go beyond your system, how many atoms are there in the universe? That many doorways are there. So we gave the freedom to create your own god. There is something called as Ishta Devata. You can choose your god. If you don't like any, you can create one. 